Am I the asshole? For splitting the bill at dinner and not letting my boyfriend pretend he paid? I have been dating Ben for eight months. For context, Ben and I are from different income brackets, and Ben has expressed that he sometimes feels a little bit weird about this because he is a gentleman at heart but he says it's hard to treat me since I'm not really impressed by his gestures. I've said many times that I'm not concerned about these kind of things either way, but it comes up periodically. Last night Ben and I went to dinner with six of my friends. There were three men in total and five women. At the end of the dinner the two guys Max and Harry said they would get the bill, as the guys usually do when we're out. Ben quietly said to me that he wasn't really comfortable with the guys paying for his dinner so I said I'd chip in with the bill. Ben said thank you but could he chip in and then I could pay him back afterwards because he didn't want them to know I was paying. This struck me as totally absurd because firstly, it's an unnecessary step, second even split the cost was something I wasn't sure he would realistically be able to cover, and third I felt like he was trying to enter a pissing contest with my friends which was just childish. I said no I would just pay and then turned to everyone and said I'd chip in a third of the bill. No one batted an eyelid, but Ben was sulking. He's now mad at me saying I emasculated him and made him look bad in front of my friends. I think he's over-dramatizing it because my friends couldn't care less and he needs to get over himself. Am I in the wrong for not letting him save face? Natar and it sounds like he didn't have the money to afford it, and he just didn't know how to tell you. Super weird. Not the asshole. I don't understand him taking credit for you paying. This is nor normal. Info what do you mean you're not really impressed by his gestures? Info why do your male friends typically pay for everyone? That seems very strange. Info why were you at a restaurant that your BF couldn't afford to be at in the first place? Or is it just that he couldn't afford to pay for multiple people's meals because of some weird thing your male friends do? came to ask if you're the asshole then proceeded to shit on him in almost every single response. Praying he leaves you if this shit keeps up. You let the guys get the bills every time the group goes out, although you make plenty of money, and are appalled at your boyfriend's sexism about money? Have I got that right? In this situation, why not just hand him your card? It's a small gesture that only the two of you will understand, and nobody else will notice. If you're not really impressed by his gestures and you are making a Reddit post about him you're looking for a reason. Grow up. Just dump him and move on. You're the asshole you invited him to a place you knew he couldn't afford. He asked you privately to help him out and you didn't. Read the social cues. You're the asshole you knew going into this scenario what would happen and you know Ben is insecure about the income situation. It seems like you're almost playing dumb here when you know exactly what this looks like. You're the asshole. You make him go to an expensive restaurant with your friends and then embarrass him in front of them which you undoubtedly knew it would. You're the asshole. Would it have killed you to be kind? And if you truly don't care. Why was it so important that you get the credit instead of him? You're the asshole. It's not about splitting the bill, it is about deliberately humiliating your BF. I mean what was the point of that? And there you go. Totally unnecessary, and you are utterly and completely the asshole here. Sounds like you both have weirdly backwards views. The two guys Max and Harry said they would get the bill, as the guys usually do when we're out. Question mark. You're the asshole but you should consider finding a BF that's more accepting of you. His feelings are his own, and you are stepping over it. Everyone is entitled to their own feelings. You need to tone your toxic masculinity down. He had already privately expressed his uncomfortableness and it made him less than. Kinda seems like you wanted a pissing contest with you being the winner. You're the asshole. It's a new relationship and he's trying to fit in with your posh friends. You're the asshole. Tell me you came from a privileged background without telling you came from a privileged background. You just don't get it, do you? 
Not the asshole I dated a guy like this and he would get so mad that I didn't let the service think he was paying. I told him to man up and get himself a decent job and he could pay all he wants, but that I wasn't putting on a front to make him look better. In photo you live in a cultural context were Max and Harry's movies considered normal and acceptable? Like the 1950s? You're the asshole. Broke man meets narcissist woman who inherited money. Match made in heaven. You're the asshole. He confided in you that he was feeling self-conscious, and you unilaterally dismissed his feelings as absurd and made a big show of doing exactly what he asked you not to do. WTF. 100 You're the asshole. Spoiled rich girl. Ben must run away. You're the asshole. Why are you with this person when you seem to have no regard for them whatsoever? Not the asshole. Ben has an outdated and sexist vision of how couples should work in terms of who pays for what. And he is too focused on his public image. You probably need a deeper conversation with him about this. I think he should have just let Max and Harry get the bill if they wanted to. They offered, so why would there be a whole song and dance about pretending to pay? Instead he said he wasn't comfortable with them paying, so you should. Weird. To me it's super weird a group of three guys just pays for the five girls meals when you go out. I guess paying for your significant other but really? I don't think that's chivalry just a kind of forced ideal that guys think they should follow. Not the asshole. He's clinging to a very outdated idea of what masculinity is. But you invited him and he was just trying to make a good impression. Up replying exclusively to people saying she's not the asshole is really all you need to know here. You're the asshole. You completely disregarded your BF's feelings. Not the asshole. But is he much for grand gestures and expecting you to be so grateful for everything he does buys you? Sounds really exhausting if he expects you to be impressed or wants to impress you.